as you can see, Derek and I are going for a very chilled, relaxed pose tonight. Um, as always, you are casual as ever. Um, but where you weren't casual was an epic, epic fight between you and Dillian White. For obviously, you narrowly lost it. You don't believe you lost it. Uh, talk me through the fight. Uh, you know what? The fight was great. Done, uh, done good numbers. Uh, Dylan turned up, had a fight himself. You know, but I think I brought more to the table. I put more pressure. I chucked more punches. You know, and uh, in, in the 12th round, I knocked him down. But that was not counted. You know, but you know what? Who cares? The rematch is going to happen. Well, that's you know, what I was about to ask you. you know. Tell me this rematch is going to happen. The rematch is going to happen. It's probably that's hiding somewhere down there anyway, as you know. You know, because he knows the big dog is around, so he can't be out and around, snoozing around, because men will rip him apart quickly. When is this rematch likely to happen? Every boxing fan wants to see this rematch. He, it was he, unbelievable. He's overpricing himself. You know, he's asked for 1.1. I told him dead on, I'll give you 1.1 out of my pocket, and let's do the fight. And I told him 50-50, he's just, he's just hiding. I told him there's no way he can go until he fights me. So do you believe if there was a rematch, you would convincingly win it? You wouldn't have to rely on the judges? If there was a rematch, I'm going to eat his heart out. Out. I'm going to eat him. I'm going to destroy him. There's no two ways about it. I'm going to basically cut the cut his shot. I'm going to fuck him up. OK, so tell me in that first fight, what you felt you didn't do enough of to get that convincing win? No, I've done everything. The only thing I didn't do, he didn't go down. He's, I hit him so hard that he fell asleep while he was up in the air, and I hit him and I woke him up. Ask him when you see him. At any point in the fight, he did not hurt me. You know, I, you, when, you hit a man, he falls asleep, you hit him, he wakes up, he goes, oh, I'm in a fight. It happened about four, five, six times in a fight. Well, obviously, the build-up was a, a low-key affair, not. Um, no, it was a very, very interesting build-up, and obviously there was a lot of dislike uh, and animosity, but surely after a fight like that, there was a little bit of respect between you two or not? I do not respect that idiot. Do you respect him for taking the level of punches and still being there standing at the end of the fight? No, I don't respect him. He needs to come back in, I want to kick his ass again. Okay, any time frame when this is going to happen? June the 4th he put on his Instagram or something, didn't he? June the 4th, he is talking crap. We better, you better sign on our paper. Whoever he wants to fight ain't going to fight him because the public ain't going to buy it. And no one wants to watch that. People want to watch the rematch. That is a simple fact. You know, it's like, all right then, if he's man enough and he thinks he can beat me, he should sign the, the, the paper. Let's do it. We fought for no title. This can be for no title. Fights with no titles, people watch because they know it's, so, it's much better. If for some reason you guys can't come to an agreement, who else is in your remit? There ain't nobody else in my thing. I'm going to get him. It's going to happen this year. Okay, well, listen, as boxing fans, we can't wait. Hopefully, it will happen soon. Thank you so much for talking yeah, to me. I'm and enjoy the rest of your night. Out, <laughs> I'm going to find him, hunt him, I'm going to whoop his backside. Good, well, we can't wait. Thank you, Derek. Thank you. <laughs>